So I guess you can still get your tickets from Mr. Animes. Oh, Mr. Animes is there actually. Nice. Which is situated at Sunai Wang Six. Maybe I can uh, get an interview with uh, Mr. Animes. <clears throat> oh, sorry. Oh, sorry, sorry. sorry. Hi, Mr. Animes. Can I interview you? Oh, sh uh, how am I going to come in? Should I uh, jump over? Uh, this is just too small a space, I'm not that thin. Oh, I get a face to face uh, talk with. Oh, okay. It's a tight fit. Oh, there goes my balls. Hey. Ah. Hiya. Okay. Uh, oh, thank you very much. Okay. I'm uh, from YouTube. I'm uh, my name is Jerry. Okay. So this is Mr. Animes. Yes, that's me. Do, I, do you like to be called Mr. Animes? Just call me Animes. Animes. Uh, are you from Taiwan? Uh, no, I'm from mainland. I'm from Shanghai. I'm Shanghai oh, Shanghai. Is, oh, yes. okay. The first time that I I saw your work, right, was uh, because of Attack on the Titans. You were doing a collaboration with another uh, person. The Easter, yes, yes. Uh, what's his name? Uh, the Easter. Ah, the Easter. Yes, yes. He pronounced it as the Easter. The Easter. The Easter. Yes, yes. Oh, do you know him in real life? Yes, I've, I've met him uh, uh, last year in Singapore when we, were, when we were doing the last performance in, in September. And this uh, this year, I've been to the, I've met him as well in the same Angeles. Oh, okay, okay. So uh, life must be very good for you. Sorry? Life must be very good for you. You are famous. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. kind of. Because but we only get to see your fingers all the time. You make your videos with the your yes, fingers yes. only. I, I actually try to hide my face as long as possible because I think it's more interesting. But now you can't. You are well known already. Your yes, face. Yes, yes. It's, it's too late. <laughs> it's too late, huh? Yeah, yeah. Would but you? I, but I will still keep the camera angle because it's ah. more interesting. Oh, okay, okay. So if I keep it like this, you can see my uh, keystrokes. Okay, don't mind me asking, how old are you? Uh, can you guess? 25? Okay, 23. 23, wow, well, very young. and. Uh, yeah, yeah. So, how did you start playing piano? Did your parents like, you must go and play piano? It's like all the Chinese, you know? Yes, 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 yes exactly. Yes. When I was six years old, my parents decided to buy a piano. I said, hey, why not learn a, why not learn a piano? And in the beginning, I wasn't very that interested, so they kind of half lost me. But only after half a year, I tried to play on myself. Because I think it's very interesting that you can create melodies so easily. It's like pressing down the key, you know? Easy for you? Uh, no, um, for example, if you have a violin, you have to work very long until you create a single clean note. And the piano, you just have to press down the key. Oh, so it's very Oh, easier piano compared to violin. It's easier. Much easier. Much oh, easier. okay. I thought the violin is based on feel, you know. Uh, yes, yes. But that's the problem. If you have so many strings, you have to make it perfect. They don't have frets, right? They don't have frets. The violins don't have those. Uh, like guitar, it's not like guitar, right? Yes, yes, yes. yes. Oh. Therefore, um, I, I like the I like to play the piano when I was very little and. Uh, when I was 10 years old, I discovered that I can play everything by ear. Oh, yes. gifted, uh, gifted. Kind, yeah, gifted, uh, I don't know, maybe it's trained. Um, but, uh, back then I cut out uh, some cartoons on the television. There were some opening songs, and I played the piano. And some, some of my friends in the school has noticed that. And they said, hey, Mike, can, uh, you can do this uh, pieces on the piano and listen to them. Okay. That's where it started to cover all pieces. Okay, so uh, you are trained Classically? Yes, yes. I've been trained by a piano, professional piano teacher when I was six years old. Since then, uh, I've, I've three different piano teachers already. Uh, currently, I'm studying in uh, the music conservatory in Rostock. Boston, is it? Rostock. Rostock? Germany. Oh, Germany. Germany. Do, so you know how to speak uh, German? Yes, I can't understand. Go for Dante Scheitzer. 
God for Dante Scheiße. <laughs> Uh, it must be very cold in uh, Germany. You're from Shanghai, right? Yes, yes. Shanghai is it as cold as Germany during winter? Uh, I haven't been to Shanghai in winter yet. I've only went, went there during my summer vacation because or else I don't have any time in Shanghai. But you were born in Shanghai, right? No, no, I was born in Germany as well. I oh, was you born and raised in Germany, and German is my first language. So oh. I'm more German than Chinese. Wait, wait. So you are German? I'm German. I'm oh. German. Oh, you speak German fluently and... Yes, 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 and English. And I just I speak German and English fluently and my, my Chinese is kind of bad. Oh, same here, I'm a banana. Yeah. A banana. As they say in Malaysia, banana ma. That means uh, I look Chinese, which is yellow. But uh, inside is uh, Western white, so I can speak only English. Oh. Uh, you never heard of that term before? No. So you learn something new. <laughs> banana ma. Banana ma means... Uh, I am, I Yellow Chinese. outside, yeah, but uh, yeah, Western, Western, yeah, okay. can speak only English. Okay, okay. So uh, you are from Rostock, right? Uh, no, that's the place I'm studying. I'm studying, but uh, I was in, born in the south of Germany. It's in uh, the town called Mettingen. Mettingen, huh? Mettingen. It's in the south of Germany. I've seen many German girls. They are nice looking, very nice, yeah, very German nice. Girls are pretty tall, and I think. Okay. I think the German girls are very tall compared to the Asian girls. Ah, definitely, definitely. And uh, more volume, yeah? yeah volume. More volume, <laughs> you get what I mean. Yes, yes, yes. So, uh, you are still currently studying, uh, yes, studying. Yes, 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 studying. Only one year left and then I get my Bachelor of Music and I can become a piano teacher. You want to be a piano teacher? Well, well that's my, my base, but of course I can still keep uh, transcribing and doing YouTube videos and maybe composing. I, I, I improvise a lot in my free time, but I just seldom record it. I always think like, oh, this sounds rubbish, ah, oh, this sounds bad. I'm very critical, so... Okay. Yeah. Do you make enough money out of your YouTube? Uh, technically, yeah. <laughs> Meanwhile, I can live from YouTube for most, but I, I'm still teaching youngsters already. <laughs> oh. Because you're allowed to teach younger people in your music school. Oh, okay, okay. Um, about the half the price of a normal piano teacher, but if you have like six piano pupils, uh, you can sell money. Oh, okay, okay. So how did you actually collaborate with the Miss the Easter on that piece? Uh, what's the name of the piece already for Attack on uh, Titans? Ah, Jo. Ah, uh, yeah. Do you know Tsubasa? Yes, yes. How did you collaborate? Are you guys from different sides of the planet? Works like this. First, I am finishing a sheet, a ba basic. No, he he finished a basic lead sheet, just the melody and the harmonics, and I am adding the details and all the runs and the crazy things. And then I send it to him, and then we both practice our each voices. And I recorded the first. I have to keep a steady tempo, and then I record. I send the record, record a video to him, and he's watching and listening to it. I try to play at the same time. Oh, he's the guy with the. Yes, he's the guy with the and he likes synthesizer. He uses synthesizer. Yes, he's he's grown up with an e piano, so he's he's more comfortable to play on a e, uh, synthesizer. Oh. And I, I am grown up with uh, acoustic grand piano. So. Okay, what kind of piano do you use? Uh, I currently I don't have, I don't own a, a piano. All the grand piano in my videos are from conservatories. I don't have a style. Oh, it's not. Uh, you didn't own it, but it's in your place of uh, studying. Uh. Yes. Yes. Oh. I'm always using the, the grand pianos in my, uh, as I put it, in, in my conservatory to record the video. Okay, the most, uh, the best video that I see is the collaboration. It was so beautiful. How long did it take you to do it? Both of you guys, how long? Yes, that's, that's, um, crazy. that's the craziest part because you know, when Ching and the Purity aired, the second opening came, we were both like, wow, that's the best opening ever. We have to work on it, the duet. We needed three days to create the sheet and four days to record. So we four days? This, we did this in one week. That's yes, fast. Yeah, we were totally crazy. We were working 14 hours a day because we want to to, 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 to make this happen. Oh, okay. Because it was such an amazing piece and we were totally hyped and inspired. Uh, yeah, it was done in a, uh, in a record time. I don't think I've done a job any faster. How many hits for that four million? Uh, the duet has almost reached 2 million already. Oh, 2 million. Yeah, yes. Okay, okay. 
I really like it. I feel wow, holy shit. Yes, yes. Holy mm -hmm. shit. It was it was a perfect piece for Jewel because uh, there are so many spaces left where you can enter inside a uh, picture here and picture there. It's always action. So uh, beforehand, is the tune is more complicated and more complex. It's yes. much better than just doing just it's, two. It's, it's, it's a lot of it's much more work because you have to think more and, co and combine more because you have twice the possibilities. So you are, you are into classical music as well? Yes, yes. I'm studying classical music and I still play classical music. Of course. So which one is your favorite composer? Beethoven. Oh, Beethoven. I yes. Like Beethoven. The sonatas. child prodigy who plays the piano. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I really love the sonatas. These are my favorite type of works. And he's also my, one of the main inspirations because um, Beethoven, he, with every new sonata, just compare the first one with the fifth one or the fifth one with the seventh one, he introduced something new and he revolutionized again with every piece. So this guy's amazing. He added and improved with every piece. Okay. That's also my goal, just to improve and make my sheet better the next time. Okay. So I'm trying to surprise surprise the people like, oh, there's something new on the left hand. Oh, he, he used a new technique. Okay, okay. So uh, you are familiar with uh, Petra Bell D. Cannon, right? Uh, yes, yes. You like it? Uh, it's played to death, unfortunately, but I can. I like it very much. Well. This is a genius combination of harmonics. And it's a canon, right? It's all, yes, all adding new and new yes, stuff. Yes. I can play it uh, for, for two hours, just, uh, uh, adding a new variation because uh, uh, I can improvise pretty well as soon as I have a, a draft, you know, like D A G E. I just have to memorize this and then the rest will just flow in my head and I just spontaneously play it. Would you make a video on Patrick Bell D Cannon? Uh, to put your spin in, on it to make it even more awesome, could uh, you do it? I can't do it, but there are already so many. Ah, there are so many. Maybe you'll do a collaboration with uh, the Easter uh, and. Yeah, yeah, probably something like this, yes. Because um, I, I, my goal is um, to, to create the pieces I really like. Uh, wow, which one? Most of them are anime pieces because I watch a lot of anime. Oh. What do you like actually? I think on Titans definitely. Yes, yes, yes. Like, uh, I like Slice of Life animes. The Moe types. Mm, Moe <laughs> yes, types. It's, it's, it's kind of it's incredible to hear this for me. Because most people are expecting me to be a very serious person, but I'm actually not. I am a true uh, anime. Yeah, I mean, you're talking about like intro word, is it? Introvert means uh, like to keep to yourself. Uh, that's not like it. I like the stuff uh, uh, featuring cute girls doing cute things. <laughs> oh, can, can you give me an example of the animes that you like? For example, the, the last uh, seasons, uh, London Beauty, for example. You probably don't know this. They are no. very niche. Okay. Or Kishuma Wabasabi just called. Yes, yes. They just aired last season. I watched 10 anime episodes. But of course I watch the mobile that I see as anyway as you know like Nisekoi Aki Gatari. First season yes good. The second season I don't understand, you know it's uh, the second season was kinda of weird. It's like a one feet is uh, ah, it's just weird, yeah. Yeah. But, so, uh, have you watched uh, Knights of Sidonia? Since you like Attack on the Titans? Oh, yes, I love the opening. Oh, yeah, yeah, I forgot how to do it. Uh, the lyrics is very, very. In describes the anime. You no, know, we'll fight them or whatever, die for Sidonia. It's great, very good. Are you going to do a piece on that? It was planned. I mentioned it on Twitter uh, that I'm going to play this, but I thought I didn't find the time and now the anime has ended and I was like, mm, is it? It's coming back in December, second season. Oh, really? Okay. The, the, uh, the opening is really awesome. I might do this. Oh, okay. It's excellent. I listened to it. Uh, so what else is, uh, do, you, do you want to do? What else anime is that uh, you want to do? The songs? As soon as I get back to, uh, to Germany, I'm going to transcribe five of the pieces I am playing uh, tonight, which are not uploaded on YouTube. I'm going to make the sheets for them and upload official video. So, uh, because 
the arrangement for all the improvisers, then they might have to play. So just have to write them down, then to add some details to make them happen. Okay, so before a performance, right, you have performed many times already in Singapore, Taiwan, I think, Japan? Yes, 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 Taipei. I've been to Japan, oh. but I plan to go to Japan. Okay, you, you don't seem like the person who gets nervous. Do you get nervous? Oh, oh no, wow. That's many people envy me of this because I'm just... Chill many, out. Many people say just, I'm pretty chill, I'm pretty naive as well. So I don't really care if I make a mistake because I just think, why are you focusing on always not making a mistake? Because you should rather focus the atmosphere, the fun. Ah. Do you make mistakes? Sorry? Do you make mistakes? Uh, it can happen, yes, but just don't worry about it. Uh, just keep calm and carry on. Oh, okay. Just now you did the uh, No Life, No Game song, right? Yes, yes. Very nice, very nice. Very nice. So do you have any questions for me, Mr. Animes? Yeah, so why, um, how did you, uh, how did you, uh, did, you know my, did you know my channel before? Only when I got into Attack on the Titans, then I wanted to know about the song because it's so awesome. Then uh, I tried to find all those uh, piano version, guitar version, whatever, then yours came out with uh, the Easter, with that particular one. The split screen, two of the pianos, and awesomeness in Zeus. It was so awesome to see four hands there, and the choreography it was just excellent. You were doing the higher notes, if I'm not mistaken, or...? Yes, yes, we split up actually. We are pretty... I, 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 I constructed it like we are equal parties, you know? I'm, I'm playing this part, he's playing this part, and then we're switching, we are going to... So there's only one collaboration only? There are two. There's two. an older one called AKB Zero 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 Ending. It's rather unknown anime, but we both really like it. Oh, okay, I will. Okay, okay. How about the J-pop? Do you go for J-pop? Uh, what is that? Watch so much anime and uh, listen to all the anime openings and insert songs. I'm saturated. Oh, saturated, no time. I don't search for another J-pop. Oh, okay, okay. So I, from Attack on Titans, I got to know your awesomeness. Uh. So any other questions? Attack on the Titans, but before that I loved uh, Legends of the Galactic Heroes. Oh, oh that's uh, oh, I see. Have you watched it? 10 episodes. 110. And worth every episode. Even though it's very old, the story is it's, great. It's, it's brilliant, it's clever. It's one you, of have the you watched it? Yes, I watched it. Uh, it's, it's one of the must-dos for every episode. Uh, yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, the songs are oh, not bad. Uh, yes, very. Yes. Classical, I think. Very classical. Yes. Yeah. It's, it's an all-time classic, which can be you can watch it in 20 years and it's still awesome. Ah, yeah, yeah. It's so, one of the few uh, immortal anime series. Oh yeah, that's very classical. Yes. Neon Genesis Evangelion when I was younger. Yes, yes. But now the new movies came out. Yeah, what, the, what the fuck? The movie was yeah, what the fuck? I don't understand. Like, why are you doing this, Hideo Kiyano? I don't understand. Understand what happened? I didn't understand anything, and even after reading. 20 pages of analysis, I still did that. It's just, it's just, it's like he's throwing us, so nothing makes sense. The, the director, Ano Hideki, is it? Yeah, yeah. He was depressed when he did the TV series, but now he's happier with ch children, right? So, I guess... But he's making, yeah. Well, let's see how the fourth movie will come. Fourth movie, I don't expect much. Third movie has really thrown me off, so fourth movie... Eh, yeah, yeah. Eh. Yeah. Man. So what else uh, anime are you watching now? I have to be following the current season, but I plan to watch Sword Art Online, Akamaga Kill. Sword Art Online? First half of the first season, nice. Second... Uh, uh, yeah, everyone agrees that the second half is kind of stupid with the alpha half because it's a little bit... Uh, I guess it was just stupid. But uh, since the second... I have many people at the second round, the second, at the third arc, uh, the gun game is going to be much better than the second oh, Much better. And yes, I personally think that girls with guns are more interesting than so guns. Oh, girls? Go with oh, guns. girls with guns. Do uh. yeah. you read manga? Uh, I, I, I think I'm more the anime type, but I read some manga in the past. Yeah. I like Pokemon and Chobits. Chobits? Yeah. Oh, it's a quite a highly regarded anime. But it looks kind of like girly, so I did not watch yeah, it. Yes, I know, I know. Uh, 
I, I found the Trumpets manga in the room of my sister and I secretly read it because they, it looks like for, for girls but like, nobody should know my secret. Oh. I just began to read it and also... In the closet or something like that, yeah, right? Yes, 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 yes. Does your sister play an instrument? She used to play the piano as well but didn't play long, like three years and she played. Yeah, you can't like uh, take your piano to New Zealand and play around like a guitar. Yes, yes, yes. So uh, after this, where are you going? I go to Singapore. Next, Sing uh, and I'm going to perform on the 15th of uh, August. 15th of August. So uh. Next week. So you never been to Malaysia just now, you say, right? Yes. So first day here today? Uh, no, I've been here. I've arrived here two days earlier, but I'm still. I still have jet lag, so I'm not. Uh, I'm still a bit tired. So it's very hot, huh? Do you feel it's yes, hot? It's, it's, it's very hot. Uh, but I think it's normal because I've been to Taiwan before. Taiwan is hot? It's super hot. It's, like it's very humid, very hot. And almost no, no wind. It's just that the, the entire air is floating uh, in the room. It's not moving. It's, super hot. it's not the same as here? It's the same as here. Same as here. Oh, okay, okay. Have you tried our food? Yes, yes, of course. What have you tried? I like it. I like I, I don't can't remember the names. It's, I really like the rice dish. With a spicy condiment. Ah, nasi lemak, fatty lemak, rice. Yes, lemak. Ah, awesome. And uh, have you tried durian? Yeah. I mean, Germany they do have right durian. I can't, I can't handle the taste. I immediately. What What does it smell like to you? Like Is it corpse? Smell like dirty socks? It smells like rotten eggs. Oh, oh rotten. It's, it's just the smell. It's not the smell. It's, it's the, the taste. The taste uh, should be very sweet. It's sweet, yeah, but it's, at the same time it tastes like rotten chicken. Rotten chicken. It, it, especially the consist cons consistency of slimy and wow. Oh, okay. I tried it multiple times and every time it's gets... Okay, what about mango steam? Uh, my sister loves mango steam. I think mango steam now. Yeah. Yeah, I think mango steam is a uh, very unique uh, fruit in Asia. Uh, Southeast Asia. Uh, Southeast Asia. Okay, yeah. I like it as well. One is, uh, mango scene is the queen of fruits, uh, whereas the durian is the king of fruits, so they kind of like opposite yeah, they ends. Go, they go together. Ah, okay. What would you like to see in Malaysia? Sorry? What would you like to see in Malaysia? Uh, probably some temples. Sometimes. I haven't, I haven't seen inside seeing yet because I haven't. No time, no, no time. Yeah. So you come here, go to Singapore, then uh, bye bye to Germany. Uh, yeah, yeah, because. <laughs> My schedule is quite packed. I have so much to do. Pe people have the misconception that you are famous, you go from one country to another and you get to see the world. But in actual fact, you don't have time. It's not scheduled. It's very, it's very tiring. It's, it's a lot of work. Oh, okay. I think it's simple because uh, being here is a um, very awesome experience. Like, uh, having your own booth is quite amazing. Okay. I I think I have uh, taken enough of your time already. You're going to have to perform at 6.30? No, it's 7.30. 7 o'clock. So, uh, Mr. Animus, any more questions? Not really. Not really. Okay. Thank you very much, Mr. Animus here. It's an honor to meet a celebrity from YouTube. <laughs> and yeah. so far away from Germany. Yes, yes, yes. yes. Holy shit. It's, it's, I think it's kind of amazing that uh, YouTube has, has made for so many people you know, all these possibilities. Like, uh, you are just a random guy somewhere in Germany, and with YouTube, you can become famous all over the world. When were you famous? Oh, when were you famous? <laughs> wow, okay. Uh, I think, you know, I, back then in 2013, in Quite May, Quite recent, huh? I got 15,000 subscribers. One year later, I got almost 200. And it's kind of advice a lot. I don't know why, but uh, it just happens. Uh, are there a lot of other people who are like you? Uh, yeah. Uh, but not as skillful as you, are you? Yes, yes. Because I'm classic trained. That's my biggest advantage. Uh, but uh, aren't there anybody else out there? The old fucks uh, doing anime music? Any old people know? Oh, I'm the only one. The only one. I'm even doing this in secret because most of my, my, my peers in, in the concentration don't know about my Do they look down on it? No, no. They, they, they say, hey, this guy can play Beatles very well. That's it. And nothing with the anime thing, they, they, they don't have any care. So you went into a niche market? 
and nobody you feel it up that's why you are famous and you have good skills everybody enjoys it so that's why you can rise and rise and rise yes i think i just choose the right um, subject at the right time yeah anime yes because i like both i like, I like piano and i like anime so i like my much, Mr. MS, uh, thank you for giving me a bit of your time. Yes, yes, of oh my god, sure. thank you very much. I, I was feeling myself as well, so I'm not that kind of a sir. I'm just a, just a YouTuber. Oh, okay. Thank, thank you very much. Okay, welcome. Can you fit? Yes, apparently. Okay. Thank you. Okay, welcome. So that's uh, Mr. Animes here. Uh, hopefully, you enjoyed the interview. So that's about it. Anybody wants to name you? No. You know why I want to do this?